welcome back to my channel my name is Mary and today's tutorial we will learn how to draw photo background in Photoshop let's get started so what we're going to do first is we we'll duplicate this background layer here by clicking on command J twice and we'll name the first layer model I'll name it model you can name it anything you like and the second layer blur so now I'll click on the model layer and that is where we'll start the blur effect so what I'll do first is I want to cut out the model from the entire background so for me to achieve that I'll select the model out of the background first so I'll be using the quick selection tool to select the model okay and you can click on the plus icon here then I'll go ahead and select the model so now we have selected the model out of the background I think we have a almost perfect job here so to make sure we get all the air in the selection we'll hold your shift and then you click on select and you click on select and mask okay so now you're just going to refine the edge here to make sure you have most of the air of the model selected in the selection okay okay so that looks good then we'll click ok and now we have our model is perfectly selected so we'll make the other layers invisible and we'll click you see the model here is perfectly selected then we're going to create a layer mask for the model layer and then we'll go to the blur layer we've already selected the model out of the background on the model layer as you can see if I make the blur layer invisible we'll see that our model is selected out of the photo so what we're going to do now is make the blur effect on the blur layer so you're going to hold your command key on your keyboard and click on the layer mask on the model layer okay and then you go up here to select to modify and to expand you can expand and you expand by you can expand by 30 pixels or 35 pixels whichever way you prefer or 25 I'll use okay let's use 35 you click OK all right then we'll right click on the image and click on fill and then we we'll click content aware fill because we want to remove the model from the photo so click on content aware fill then you click on ok and then our model will be out of the image as you can see here our model is no more on the image so you can make the model layer invisible so now you deselect you can click on command D to deselect then you click on filter you go to blur and lens blur to give the background a very good blur you can decide what kind of blur level you want if you don't want it too much you can adjust it here and if you want it to be very very effective you can take it to 100 then you click on ok and then we have our blow background then if you make the model layer visible back you will see that we have a very very nice blur effect on the background of this photo okay so what we can do to make this picture look good we can add some effects can you go to color lookup 
um, let's add um, let's see let's add this one fall color and you can see the picture is looking very very bright then we can just group this effect layer here by clicking command G and see what we have before and this is what we have now so we've been able to achieve this by first selecting the model out of the photo and then blurring the background itself okay so this is what we have before and this is what we have now okay so you can use this also on your images you might not um, really need to get some very very expensive lenses with this um, trick you can get a very blur background on your photos and images so thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment and i'll see you next time have a good day god bless stay safe and bye bye